Okay, first game of a long running of games, and we're going to take on Everton to begin the episode. Uh, hopefully, we can pick up three points here. Everton are got you know some decent players, so it's obviously going to be a challenge. But let's see how we do away at Goodison Park. Come on, Leicester City. Oh, chance here, maybe. Fatua, great ball into Edward with the strike, and Pickford with the save. First chance of the game goes begging. Oh, Fatawa, great ball. Edward of a chance. He powered his way through. It's Edward. It's 1 0 Leicester. Great ball there. Hamanson played a great ball out wide to Fatawa. Then Fatawa with a great cut in. And then a fantastic ball to find Edward. And Edward, despite, you know, with the great ball, Fatawa still has a lot of work to do as he beats Jared Brantway and finishes the ball into the far, uh, into the top left corner. Let's go. 1-0 Leicester. Corner kick here. Fatua. Ball in. Trying to find Edward with the header. And it's just over the bar. Oh, no chance here for Everton. And Dye with the shot. Straight at Hermanson. Free kick into Everton. Quite a far distance out. Lindstrom is over it. Up and over the wall. And Miles over the bar. Chance here, maybe, for Everton. Lindstrom, well, one there from Pereira. And that will be our time at 1-0 Leicester as we go into the break. El Cajuna, straight at Pickford, good save. Oh, El Cajuna skits past Brantway. El Cajuna skits past Coleman. Chance here, maybe. El Cajuna doing brilliantly here for Leicester. Shot wide. Inches away. Pass and Daka gets away from the Everton defence. Pass and Daka doing brilliantly. Daka's in one on one. If Pass and Daka, great start from Pickford. What a save. Always have good starts to episodes. And that's continued here. Leicester City beat Everton 1 0. Could have easily been a lot more if it wasn't for Jordan Pickford. But Everton's relegation worries in this career mode get bigger. And surely, I don't want to jinx it, but. I think we're staying up this season. We are, you know, I don't know what point all that takes us up to. But then again, we've still got to, you know, play many more games. And we got Arsenal next, which we might get humbled. <laughs> this game is going to be against Arsenal. Not looking forward to this one. Arsenal battered us last time we played them. Uh, a few changes to the side. Uh, Justin comes in at right back. Campaz also comes in on the left-hand side at left mid. Really like Campaz, you know. He's played a few of the games and got a few comments from you guys, uh, you know, in the Discord and also on the streams. Really liking that uh, signing. Uh, do let me know your thoughts in the comments if you guys are enjoying this save. Let me know your thoughts on what you guys can I can do to improve it. Or I am trying to keep it regular, you know, at least every other day. Sometimes it has been challenging, but I feel like I'm doing all right with it. But anyway, let's take on uh, Arsenal. <laughs> Difficult game. Oh, great ball there for Arsenal. Saka, 1-0. Five minutes in, Arsenal score already. This I think this just shows you the gulp in quality between both of our sides. But Saka makes it 1-0. There was a lovely bit of passing movement from Arsenal. And then great ball into Saka, who's in one-on-one. -on -one. He just toe-pokes it back at Manson. 1-0 Arsenal. Oh, no, great chance for Arsenal. Martinelli into Saka. Saka, great stop from Manson. Almost 2-0 Arsenal in 11 minutes. Oh, no, great chance here for Arsenal. 2-0. Gabriel Jesus, 25 minutes in. We done, we done okay, but yeah, Gabriel Jesus, 2-0 Arsenal. Martinelli, shot play through to Saka, 3-0, not even half time yet, 3-0 Arsenal, and now it's half time, Saka, yeah, we are struggling. Bad change there from FaZe on Martinelli, we could be in a bit of trouble here with FaZe. And it's a red card. 
it, things couldn't have gone any worse for us. Okay, so we should time, I guess. We're going to make a few changes. Uh, I'm going to bring on Vestergaard. Uh, Teeth Chong is actually going to make his first start here. What well, is his first start? His first game here for Leicester City to replace Fatawa. And I'm also going to bring on Patterson Dacker to replace Edward. Honestly, 3 0 Arsenal. We haven't offered anything. But then again, neither of Arsenal in the second half. Oh, great ball for the Saka. Great stop from Manson. Rebound. 4 0 Arsenal. And this is worse than the performance at the Emirates. 4 0 Arsenal. Hat trick for Saka. Game set match. That's it. Full time. 4 0 Arsenal. Yeah, I think mean, the less we talk about the half, the better. And the less we talk about this game. I mean, that just kind of takes us a bit down to earth, really, showing us where we are still as a football club. But anyway, 4 0 Arsenal. Full time. Not a good result. Okay, next game here is going to be against Brentford. This team is going to go. Not too many changes. Daka, Sumeri, and Cody comes in as we take on Brentford. A uh, game that on paper is definitely a winnable fixture. Uh, even though I feel like they are above us in the league at the moment. However, Brentford. So it might be a challenge. Obviously, they've got some really good players. Obviously, in Puebo. They don't have Wieser anymore. As we saw, he was at Everton in the game. Uh, they got that Iorga, Thomas guy up top. You know, he always seems to be a threat. Well, playing against on career mode and Kevin Sharder as well. Nordgaard, not a bad defence either. Even Pinnock, uh, you know, solid goalkeeper as well in Flecken. This should be an interesting game. Let's see how we do against Brentford. Great chance it made for Brentford. Brian Embuemo, well won. Great ball there from Daka to find Campaz. Campaz in down the left side. Great opportunity here maybe for Leicester. Campaz still going. Shoots across goal. Great start. Fats with the rebound. It's an incredible double save there from Flecken to deny Leicester City the opening goal. Oh no, it's found its way through. Great chance here maybe. Lewis Potter. Thiago. Chance here in Buemo. Wiggles his way through. And Brentford with the lead against Leicester City. Honestly, I was still annoyed with that double save from the Brentford keeper, Flecken. How on earth we didn't score that? But Brentford, with their first shot of the game, they score 1-0 Brentford, who we did lose to them earlier on in the season. El Cajunas, great ball, Campas, Ting it up, Fatua, response from Leicester City. The front three linking up. Fatua, El Cajunas and Campas. 1-1. One, one. Let's go. Come on. Abdul Fatua with the goal. It's in now for Brentford and Buemo. Jan Lett. Chance just for the break. Good challenge. Evan Christiansen. We can't get rid of it though. But that should be half time and it is. 1-1 one, one going the break. Brentford went in front through Brian and Buemo, who was the man which destroyed us, you know, last time we played them. Um, however, Abdul Fatua, the very quick response to a lovely bit of passage to play. 1-1 one, one, half time. Ball, teeing it up. Oh no, chance here. Jan Lett. Stun the ball. Trying to flick it behind him. Hansen's there. Anyway, there we have it. 1-1. One, one. Honestly, a really. Boring second half, to be honest. If you need the team massively threatened, apart from Abdul Fatawa, I think. I think it was Abdul Fatawa, anyway. But yeah, full time, 1 1, fair result. Next game of the season here is going to be against the Hammers. Uh, quite a rotated team for us. Vardy, Brunanate, Winks all come in. Faze returns back after suspension. Let's take on West Ham United. Not an easy team to play against after that draw against Brentford. Let's see how we can do. Come on, Leicester City. Chance here for West Ham. Shot well blocked. Rebounds. Ings. Great stop from Manson. Oh, no. Chads. Oh, that was beautiful from West Ham. And Ings' effort is well saved. Half time at 0-0. Nil -nil. Nothing really say, really, apart from both teams have had some really good chances. But 0-0. Nil -nil. Oh, Vardy. Jamie Vardy here for Leicester. It's Vardy. What a start to the second half. He might be retiring, but he still wants to make an impact. 1 0 Leicester. Some of Iol. Okay, free kick here to Leicester. Uh, not Leicester, sorry. West Ham on the edge of the box. 
I'm intrigued to see how this one's going to go. They're up and over the wall. And it's in the back of the net. Wow, what a game. What a start the second half. Jared Bowen, 1-1. One, one. Chance here now for West Ham. Shot from distance. What an effort. Manson with the save. This game is mental here at the moment. Better than cleared. We're now counter-attacking. El Cajunas. Ah. Oh, no. Campads in down the left side. We all know he's got the pace. Well, the technical ability. Campads does so well. Campads into Vardy. Falls into Budanate. Big block. Oh, bad change again here from Winks. We're giving away another free kick a little bit further out this time. But Harry Wint's going to be booked a yellow card. And we're now going to make ourselves some substitutions as we approach the, towards the end of this game. Deco Dover Reed is going to come on to actually replace Jamie Vardy. Uh, Tahith Chong is going to come on to place Campads. Oliver Skip is going to come on to place Winks. And Yannick Vestergaard is going to come on to place Okoli. So, yeah, so we approach. So, we, what are we in? The final 15 minutes? This game could go either way at the moment. Chance here now. Over the wall from Bo. Oh, no, it's not over the wall. It's a good block. Final, maybe. Bit of action here for the Hammers. Skip trying to get in with the challenge. Finds Mohamed Kudders. Ah, well, we'll never Christian. And that will probably be time now. And it is. Deco Do Reed has picked up a little bit of a knock. But full time, 1-1. One, one. We scored very early on uh, in the second half with Jamie Vardy to take us the lead. And then Bowen with a free kick goal to level it. Game could have gone either way, but I think a draw is a fair result. Next game here against Chelsea. Um, should be an interesting game, especially away from home. They've got some, obviously... Fantastic players. I feel like I'm repeating myself most of the time. But we've made quite a few changes to the lineup. You know, Patterson Daka comes in. Ricardo Pereira comes in. Uh, I think... I don't know who I brought. I can't remember. I think Fatawa comes back in. I started him a right mid this time. Uh, so, yeah. Let's see how we do here against Chelsea. Come on, Leicester. Nice passing movement here from Chelsea. Modric from distance. Straight at the keeper. Breaking forward here. Fatua. Chance here, maybe. Gonna try and fit the ball through to Daka. Patterson Daka's in down the left side. Daka shoots cross goal. Great stop from Sanchez. Daka in down the left side. We all know he's got the pace. Flash the ball across. It's a penalty to Leicester. As Daka flashes them all across. Chelsea play with the foul. Chelsea players ain't happy. I think they're making the argument that Daka already played the ball as Badashelli went into it. But that is a penalty. And we've got ourselves a chance here from the spot. And Chelsea already make themselves substitution. Sancho's on. And a chance here from the penalty spot. Pass and Daka. Going to go bottom left. Daka here. Goal! Leicester City leads, celebrating the away ends. 1-0 Leicester City. And Cuckoo, great stop from Amanson. Oh my days, we might be away. We're away. Campas, the Colombian versus Gusto. Gusto, Campas still going. It's Campas. Gusto does so well. Gusto may win the battle there, but he won't win the war. Okay, looks like we're going to go into the break. 1-0 Leicester here for Chelsea. What a, what a last, you know, couple of minutes this has been. Chelsea had a great chance to score. Then Cuckoo, great start. We go in the break. 1-0 here with Leicester City. However, we are going to make ourselves a change. Fatua picked up a knock, which obviously is really bad news. And I'm going to sort of bring on Pernanate to replace him. Uh, just to be safe rather than sorry. Second half. Still 1-0 Leicester. Oh, Elika Hunas plays in. Daka. Daka's in. Chance for 2-0. He's done it. Celebration galore there from Chelsea. Oh, from Leicester City, sorry. And 2-0 pass to Daka at the double. He has had a great time at Leicester City since signing from Salzburg. But he has found his form under Steve Cooper. And Leicester City are 2-0 in front. Away at the bridge. I wake up thinking myself, exhale to 
Chance here for Chelsea. Jackson loops over the keeper. And this game is turning into a goal fest. Chelsea pull one back. Nicholas Jackson. Nicholas Jackson. All right, one, two, yeah, Sancho plays a great ball through here from Jackson. He gets ahead of Woot fades, and Manson comes out. Just the slightest little dink over her Manson, and he's in the back of the net. Game on. Oh, no, this is terrible news. Campas has gone down here for Leicester City, who's a player which I've absolutely loved. Chong going to come on to replace him. New signing replaced by another. Well, it's really disappointing. It was going to get ourselves some more subs to hopefully try and shore up this result. Soon Ray comes on to place Winks. And then will be my changes here. 2 1 Leicester with 15 left to play. Maybe Jaden Sancho. Felix. Straight out of Manson. Corner kick. Ball whipped in. Headed away. Volley on the edge of the box. Blocked. Oh, no. Jackson. Nicholas Jackson challenge from Woot Faze. And a last chance here now for Chelsea. Corner kick going to come on. McAteer's going to make some Kahunas because why not? <laughs> Hopefully bring down the second. Chelsea of a late corner. We are hanging on. Ball now whipped in. Headed away from Pereira. Headed away from McAteer. And that will hopefully be that. As we're looking to try and break away. And we have Leicester City. The famous victory against Chelsea. 2-1 Leicester. Come on. So, let's go through the injuries. You guys can't really see it, but Campaz will be out for two months. And Fata will be out for five days. So, Fata will be fine. He might miss the United game, but losing Campaz for two months could be a big blow. Okay, so this is where I'm going to end off the episode. Eight wins, eight draws, 12 losses. Can I say a massive thank you to all you guys supporting the channel so far? This side of the league table is looking very much interested. Looks like Forest will work relegated, even though they haven't done that bad. Obviously, I know only winning one game, but drawing 12. A bit the same with Bournemouth as well. They drew far too many games. I haven't lost as many. Uh, but yeah, this is... Obviously, goal scoring is our big problem. Only 24 goals is actually the lowest goal scorers in the league. Uh, in terms of the top end of the table, this is how it looked for them. It looks like City are running away with it. But can I say much thank you to everybody watching this series so far. If you guys have enjoyed it, drop a like, subscribe. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day, everybody. See you all soon.